what we try to do every radio row and every time we do Super Bowl media day, we try to find someone with the toughest last name to pronounce. I think you win on the Atlanta Falcons. Can you please say your last name for us? Okay, Tia Lavea. Tia Lavea. Are you cool though. Yeah, yeah. What does it mean? Does it mean something? Um, I don't know what it means, uh, but it, I'm 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 Samoan. My dad's Samoan, so um, yeah. Everybody it, everybody gets freaked out when they see all the vowels, man. But uh, it, it's it's simple once you know it. Yeah. See, I would make make something up though. Like it's like man who kills people who ask stupid questions. <laughs> I, I could have made something up, but I didn't want to be. I want my family to know and, and be like, "What is he telling people?" So you know, what I'm saying, I don't know. I'll be honest, I don't know. Our producers gave us like this long description of your last name. I'm thinking, like, what's the worst you've heard it pronounced, or do people just give up on it? Okay, so I don't know why. Every time somebody say my name, they always put an R in it. So I don't know why. And I've always heard a D in there sometimes. And so like, T L Devera. I'm like, I don't, I don't even know where. I don't even know what they're reading. So it's, yeah, my, I remember when I was in college, we played on ESPN, and my grandma. My, we, my grandma watched the games, and they would never pronounce my name right. And she would always get mad and say, how are they going to know that's my grandson if they can't pronounce your name right? you got to let them know. And I'm like, I don't know, Grandma. Shoot, I don't know. No, DJ short for something we're assuming, too. Like, what's no. the full Samoan name? Give it to us. My, my, it's not really, it's not It's not that hard. So my full name is Donald Vili T. Alavea Jr. Right. Yeah. That's not too bad. That's not, that's not bad. Do you ever get anybody to do the Aka and all that? Yeah, yeah. I, 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 we usually do it in, in college or in, in stuff. Not here not here uh, in Atlanta. They don't. They don't do it. Does it doesn't work in Atlanta? Nah, nah. <laughs> doesn't translate. I'll bring it out next year. I'll bring it out next year. Now, the, the, I, I know Levac's gonna kill me on this. There's a good pro wrestling Samoan past. The past football players, Roman Reigns. He's got the ponytail. He's got the beard. <laughs> Are we talking about like a Roman Reigns body double? You about to get into some pro wrestling after this? Hey, I might. I get that almost every day. Everybody always think confused me with Roman Reigns and, and all that. I might. I might have to be a stunt double. Maybe Jason Momoa uh, and go and go to Hollywood, <laughs> do something. You know, after the football's done. No, so you catch a couple touchdowns on Sunday, and then they'll be your stunt double. I hope so, man. That'll be a dream come true right there. <laughs> if you guys win the Super Bowl, don't ask for the ring. Get the championship belt and just walk around as Roman Reigns, all right? I'll do that. I got to go find one. I'll go do that. And then we got one last request. Okay. Bring back the Dirty Bird. Come on. The Dirty Bird. I'll bring it up. I'm sure there's a lot of guys that, that, that feel the same way as you, so uh, uh, stay tuned. Stay tuned. Good luck, man. Right, DJ, appreciate the time, man. Yeah, thanks.